truly incredible private collection. And that's what we have on display here, over uh, 485 lots, I think, yeah. of uh, you know, some of the best baseball memorabilia I've ever had anything to do with. And I've been doing this for about 25 years. So it's, it's great stuff from uh, the 1860s all the way up to current days. Um, we have some Derek Jeter stuff here, so. Yeah, it's very exciting material. Um, a lot of very unique and uh, quality material, and it kind of covers a little bit of everything, you know, from obviously the major leagues, the Negro leagues, Cuban baseball, women in baseball. The collector had a real broad spectrum of interests, and uh, and that's represented here in the in the material. So, is the collector deceased? No. Uh, but he wishes to remain anonymous. He would oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Why? That's his prerogative, you know. I mean, uh, a lot of time collectors yeah. want to remain anonymous. There's no, you know. Yeah. Has, How many years has it been um, collected? This? It's definitely been, you know, at least ten years, probably more. Uh, this is uh, this is representative of somebody who obviously. Knew what they were, knew what they were doing, knew what they were looking for, and went and, and collected it, and then decided to kind of share it with the world through this website, which is actually really an interesting website if you may have a chance to go look at it. It's uh, you know filled with writers and uh, historians and their takes on various baseball things, which we kind of tried to put in the catalog itself. Some of those essays. It's very interesting. It's a collector, a fan, or an investor? I would say this collector is a, a real fan. How can you have part with it? Well, you know, uh, there's many reasons why collectors eventually, you know, part with their material. One of the reasons, and one of the reasons the National Pastime is put out, is basically, you know, this stuff has been kind of in one place. No one else really got to see it, and, mm. and now, you know, it's out there for the world Shared to see. Shared with the world, and, uh, and that's part of the part of the idea. Yeah. Is this the first time it's been publicly shown? Yes, this is the first time the entire. You know, collection. Again, this is just selections of. This isn't the whole collection. This is what we chose from the collection. So it's, it's a pretty vast collection. But these are some of the most important pieces. And uh, this is the first time that the whole thing um, has been on display. We did do uh, smaller tours of the material in various cities. Uh, 